Can you just ring me back, Graham, and let me know where you are? Thanks. Oh, hey, come in, come in. Wait, Leo is just upstairs. Is he packing for France? Oh, God. You spoken to Graham, then? Spoken to? No. Witnessed, yeah. And he was in fine form. Let me tell you, just the kind of man I want stealing my son away with you, if that was going to happen, which it's not. I was going to tell you. On a postcard? No, of course not. I tried, Marlon. More than once, OK? But it just was never the right time. Obviously, we need to talk. Oh, the time to do that was before you made this decision, which I'm reversing, by the way. You don't get to do that. Oh, I'm sorry, is it just you who gets to make unilateral decisions that will affect my son for the rest of his life? Marlon, I'm his mother. And I'm his father. And you've tried this before with that New Zealand business. Remember, and how did that work out for you? That was a totally different circumstances. But the outcome was the same as this is going to be. You're on very, very dodgy legal ground, Rona. And even if you weren't... Marlon, New Zealand... It was a big deal, I get that, but it was half a planet away. France... It isn't far. No, my house isn't far. It's just over there. It's France over there. No, then it's far. Too far to move my son to. But as I say, that's not a problem because you're not going. You're not going, you're not going, Rona. The end. <laughs>